Hi, I'm Katie. And I'm Ethan. Congratulations on being part of a Stage 2 show this term. This is the Crescent Theatre. This is where Stage 2 does most of their productions, whether it be in the main house or the studio. Should you go in and have a look? In this short film, we'll be explaining to you about the importance of punctuality in production week. Showing you the size and scale of the stage. Showing you around the dressing rooms and the wings. Showing you the impact that real lighting and sound would give. And hopefully getting you as excited about stage two shows as we are. The Crescent Theatre is just off Broad Street in Brindley Place. It's easy to get to as it is near Five Ways train station and a walkable distance from any bus stopping town and has a car park next door. It is a professional space and therefore a great venue to work in. When you arrive at the theatre, please remember to be as changed and ready as possible. When you arrive, you'll be asked to line up in lines outside. You'll then be brought inside and asked to register here. You'll register here, then be asked to line up there to be ready to take them through into the dressing room, which is where we're going next. But remember, being in a professional space like this means you have to do what you're told, when you're told and how you're told. This is the route you'll take from reception to the dressing rooms. This is one of three dressing rooms. You all have your own individual space here and it's really important you keep that space clean and tidy. In your individual space you'll be getting changed and ready and if you're a chorus member you'll be waiting in here to be in between scenes. These are the counters. You'll either put your stuff underneath them or on top of the shelves. It's really important you keep these counters clear for people to sit on. Over here there are two sinks and two toilets so you don't have to go out of the dressing room until you're being called on stage. So you've seen the dressing rooms, now we're going to be taking you through to the auditorium. This is where the real fun begins. Welcome to the Crescent Main House Auditorium. The stage won't usually look like this, as we are currently building a set for another show. But probably the first thing you notice is the size of the stage. It's massive compared to the studios. So try to get used to the space and think about how your scenes will fill it. You need to think about how the markings we used on the floor in rehearsals will translate to a real set with real heights. This is an example of one of our Shakespeare shows, Romeo and Juliet. This is the audience. As you can see, it's pretty big, so at least one person will be watching you at any time. This means you have to focus as much as possible on stage. These are the stairs and the galleries. They're both identical on each side, and you may be using them as acting spaces during the show. There are many different ways of getting on and off stage. You may have heard of the term, the Toblerone door. This is the Toblerone door. You may remember this because it has Toblerone shapes going across it. This is the theatre door. The wings are where you'll make most of your entrances and also where the props are kept on the props table so it's important to get used to the space. One thing to think about when waiting to come on stage is whether the audience can see you. We call this sight lines. If you can see them, they can see you. There are creaky floors in the wings. So watch out for the markings. Also, the stage right wings are very small and have a massive metal grid in them so if you bash it, it may make a loud sound and ruin the show. As well. Remember, it's going to be very dark, with only a small, pale blue light for you to see. So be very aware of your surroundings. Finally, remember how close you are to the audience. You must be silent at all times in the wings, otherwise they will hear you. Let's go to the back corridor. This is the back corridor. Down there are the stage left wings. The back corridor is used to swap from one side of the wings to the other. It's also used to get back to the dressing rooms. Don't worry about getting lost, as our chaperones will accompany you everywhere you need to be. Now we're going to go back to the dressing rooms. And so our tour has brought us back to the dressing room. So that's it from us. We've shown you around, highlighted the different aspects that will be different between rehearsals and production. So remember all of this through the rehearsal process and you'll be fully prepared for production week. A huge good look from us. And break a leg. We, we know, know you'll be fantastic! fantastic.